Okay. Let's unbox. Another nice the big box. The entire frame is box. <laughs> It's got a good weight to it. Bella plus canvas, Los Angeles. Okay, I'll put this, this big box on my lap here. I'm doing a no-no, I'm not cutting away. Or right towards me. <laughs> I'm left-handed. <laughs> Why do we pick this side? Okay. You know what, we okay. got through okay. it. Okay, we're, we're done with the tape. Whew. Okay. I see a shirt. I see a shirt too. We'll start with extra small. And it's so colorful. Oh my gosh. It has such a minimal color palette. Look, it's a t-shirt. Here, hold this up. I so. will hold this up. All right. Oh, very cool. Look at that. Yep, I can confirm it's a right hand. What? What's on the back? What's Let's look at the back. Oh, well, we got to rep who we are. What this is all about is that there's a rule called the right hand rule, and it makes all of vectors and matrices work properly. And if you're looking at your right hand, you can try it yourself. First, go out and X with your pointer. Then with your next finger, your middle finger, that's Y. Now, if you move from X to Y, your thumb is the positive Z direction. It's not down, it's up. That is how you know that it's a right-handed coordinate system, which is very important. I actually can't remember why it's important, but I just remember, never do it the other way. <laughs> For anybody working on robots that needs to know about vectors and things like that, now you have a handy symbol and it looks like, uh, you know, those who know, know. If you know, Why you know. Why would you hold up a right-hand rule? That, you always have it with you. And uh, you can enjoy this shirt and represent Luke. It's very comfortable. Awesome. Peace out. Peace Thank out. You. Bye. <laughs>